people, what up party people, it's your boy Neek here, me in the movies, and don't fuck with me right now, yo, after like 40 fucking years or something like that, we got John Rambo coming back one last time, I ain't, no, 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 no fucking around, we had to see fucking Rambo, yo, we're gonna see it right fucking now, yo, let's get our tickets, let's get in there, see Rambo, that's all we talking about right now, There's other shit popping off later on tonight, but I'm fuck, Rambo time, god damn it, John fucking Rambo. He's home trying to fucking enjoy his life at home and shit. Fuck it. Let's get in there. Let's fuck it. Let's get in there. Yeah. Like I said, boy. Without further ado, we're about to see this boy John Rambo do it for the last time. Last blood. John Rambo, boy. Yeah, so we're about to go check it out. Get our tickets. Get cracking right now. We're going to talk about nothing else but John Rambo. You know, after the 10 year absence of it, uh, the last one, which was just called Rambo, I prefer to call it Rambo Pearl the Cobra. Mm. Um, yeah, we're back one more time. He's home, but he's still protecting his fucking country and shit like that. And his home, fucking country, his home and his family, yo. It's John Rambo time, y'all. Here we go, y'all. Here we go. Rambo, last blood. Yes, yeah, the last time John Rambo's got stepping up the bat, protecting his uh, homeland, getting his, his family in order, his, his niece. Yo, without further ado, let's get in there right now. Yeah. Definitely wasn't as good as the last one, but you know, for the thoughts, for the thoughts. I gotta handle business with this situation. So, Rambo Last Blood. Um, I gotta say, Rambo Last Blood was way too short. It, it was an hour and 29 minutes. They spent like the good 30, first 30 minutes, first half hour of it, developing a little relationship with the niece, and I still didn't uh, get a connection with, uh, didn't really care too much about that at all. Um, it just, and, and then, you know, it, it, it just spent way too much time developing this and, and then getting, developing the niece connection and then getting get to Mexico and it just, uh, it, was a, it was a bunch of fluff in there. And I, but I was surprised that they, they treated a character that I thought would survive. Well, yeah, I was survive, I was surprised by one little aspect of it, but that, but that wasn't enough to carry the movie along it was actually a, a little bit of a downer um it, it, it was just a little too too swift and too uh you know for, force fed with you know with what, everything with Rambo does you know what I mean it didn't feel like a Rambo movie because it wasn't in the typical Rambo environment um it was Stallone doing his thing it was it was crazy action at the end but the overall story wasn't fulfilling like the the 10 year uh ago joint uh, Rambo 2008 or 2009, whatever that was. Basically, Rambo Burma. You know what I mean? That was just a beautiful masterpiece of a Rambo movie. That was just the brawn and the brains put together, I think, with Rambo, if you can ever say that about Rambo. But this one, Rambo Last Blood, it's, it's fitting to be the last blood. You know, put it away. Uh, there's nothing much more you can do with Rambo. Uh, a, a, a good look to Stallone for giving us this last little morsel, but it didn't really satisfy as it should have. With, with Rambo, uh, it, it was pretty cool, but not cool enough, you know. But it was, it was I, it was I basically. So, anyways, boy Nick, me in the movies. Catch y'all next time, next flick. Like actually, in an hour from now, but check out, or maybe even less, half hour. No, an hour from now, I'm gonna check out Ad Astra.